that's week seven yeah. and um, yeah we're halfway through uh, we're starting the second half now I'm not gonna lie the first half is a bit rocky and it's like being on a boat and you're like you know, and it's rocking hard out and you know, it's, yeah. this half we're gonna try and stay solid for Malosi okay. yeah. this exercise feels so awkward for me Yeah, anyway. <laughs> uh, chin down, face forward. Yeah, there. Nice. <laughs> Richie's first time doing hip thrust. <laughs> Wifey right in the new uh, suit uh, flip right there. I live up to the name and GTL baby, you know the vibes. Is that your PB? What do we got? Have you done heavier than that? Damn, okay, okay. GTL baby, you know the vibes. That's mad. Nice, nice. Ready? <laughs> yeah. Let's go, baby. Feel it in your booty? <laughs> Is it popping? Burning? <laughs> On the squat rack now. I'm gonna do some warm ups for us with just the bar. Hey. How heavy he is. You ready? So. Do I need to slap your back? No. <laughs> <laughs> Scope. Easy. Easy. You ready? You got it. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Easy. Let's go. Easy. Mad push. I don't do squats, but. But you've done a hundred before. Mm. Yeah. Have you done it lately, like since our challenge now? I've done it since last year. Oh, yeah, because you've been doing more leg press, eh? Mm. <sighs> My whole, um, I've been telling everyone I'm going to try and get legs without squatting. Oh, <laughs> it's been working, though, yo, for uh, you, yeah. Just from the, the um, deadlift part. Yeah. Like, they're not even doing deadlift. What's it called? And the leg press. Yeah. Leg yeah. Press. Mm. <laughs> you ready? 
you know, there's people that don't squat. This is how you walk. You know, there's people walk across the <laughs> Let's go. How do you feel? Yeah, I thought I could do another two, maybe. One. I could hear my knees. <laughs> Did you hear it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, baby, let's get it. Is this a PB for you? Let's get it. 90. I think you you did eight reps before, so you can at least get one or two. That's a good 20 PB job. I don't know technique or that but I know like numbers <laughs> shut your mouth Richie oh. yeah but let's go babe come on let's get it get it girl let them know who you repping girl 90 on the bar Ooh, let's go babe let's go let's go up 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 Easy, easy. One more, one more. Up, 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 up. Let's go. Give me some, baby. Let's. Bro, you did a good ass, though. Good job, baby. That's mad. We're on the leg press now. Richie's favorite leg. Um, leg machine, eh? <laughs> leg workout <laughs> exercise. Uh, I didn't really do this because it's not in my program, but I should. <laughs> nice. Oh, we're gonna pump it, eh? We're gonna do the calf raises. Yeah, yeah. Toe taps, toe taps. <laughs> what I do here is I just look outside the mirror, mm -hmm. or the window, and I just do my squats. Just think about life. Visualize my legs being big. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Easy, easy. These are called uh, reverse bolelo. <laughs> what are they called? Reverse lunges. Reverse lunges. That's what they're called. For a punda. Richie is now doing 160, four plates on each side. Get into the mode. Get into the mode. Or if he's doing the same as me, I think it's 160. Oh, oh. Easy one rep. Nice. 
Mang yele reverse lunch. So if you're looking at grow the bunda and the trap muscles, uh, this is the right exercise for you. 101 getting a big bunda. Mangaya, mangaya. Qua retract, dale masonga. Nice. Pushing off our workout with the leg extension. And uh, superset it with the. What do you call this one? Falling a little stretching along. Yeah. Avoid. Yeah. Lean forward. Yeah. Nice. Basically what we're doing here is we're trying to get this muscle to come out, which it is. There it is. Nice. Extract. Contract. Listen to me girl and you're gonna get a big bunda. Alright? <laughs> Workout done. One down again. I'm gonna go um, to one of the cake shops that I get our cake supplies from. And we're hoping this week we can take you guys through a bit of the sweets you cherish. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head off first to my dream cake, grab some stuff, and then yeah, I'll show you guys the rest of the process. It's a long one. We are here at my dream cakes. This age. Oh damn, girl! After leg leg workout, you got taller. <laughs> what is it? Yeah. Nine to eighty-five cents. Eighty-five cents. Oh, true. That's, that shouldn't be double because nine is only like. I know. Just take twenty. Just you end up getting. Sixteen. Let's go. Eleven. Let's go. So I grabbed ten of those. It's a dollar thirty just for one, and then we're gonna grab thirteen. Thirteen. Dollar eighty. What the heck? They yeah. want. Let me just grab six of these as we we don't really have um, we don't really get thirteen that much. It's yeah. usually if people are getting tiered cakes. These boards you don't even see them. They're oh. like what the cakes on top sort of. Eh? Yeah. And we actually use two for each cake, so we use one at the bottom and one at the, the top. top. So we get the yeah the sharp edges. And that's a dollar. That's a dollar forty. Dollar thirty. Yeah. That's two dollars sixty just on something yeah. that we don't even see. So like um, when you order side cakes, this is what I would go with. Mm. I would prefer the black. I prefer the black boards, but because the main cake is going to be sitting on a white board as well, yeah. it would just look off if the main cake is on white and then the yeah. side cakes are on black. They used to sell these in black, but for some reason the supply is not making it any more in black, just white, which is yeah. annoying. These are, oh, these are more. They cost more, the no, black it's ones. Yeah. Oh, so, so they're the same. Yeah, they're okay. all the same. What have we got? Like, what side cake is this? Yeah, side cake, so I need five for side cakes and a double barrel. The seven inch double barrel goes in there. Yeah. I'm trying to think if I should get extra side cakes. Yeah. We're here on the. These are the main cakes. These yeah. are like they call them drum. Drum 
it's because they're thicker. These are, it keeps your cake from cracking and yes, that, eh? If you do tiered cakes, go for these. Like, if you can get these, get them. But be careful because they sell some that look like this, like yeah, this but, but they they're are so, like, foam, flimsy, eh? Yeah, yeah they're, they're foam. They feel like they're like foam. Like, these will hold our. Um, oh, that's five nine dollars. Tier, tier, oh. like, like three tier cakes. Like, yeah. This is your best support. They're pretty much 10 bucks for just that board. Yeah, this one's 11 for 16 and then $10, 10. for the 14 So it's quite a bit of cost just... Yeah, <laughs> We haven't even said... Yeah. <laughs> even the box that the cake goes in is pretty expensive. Yeah, eh? it's so hard to source. We get it from the cake pot. So if you need um, like sturdy hard cake boxes, boxes yeah. here in Australia, go to the cake pot. They're the best. Let's go. I'm grabbing some boxes for the side cakes. Um, you can grab it yourself or you can ask us and we can just add it to the cost. There it's easy for people because when they do the side cakes, normally it's getting gifted to like mm. 50 hours or something like that. So yeah. like, and if we set up, we don't buy the boxes. We, we come up, yeah. we, we set it up, yeah, we come. Yeah. Yeah. So this person, they asked for it, so we're grabbing them. This. All colors galore up in here. Look at that. All the different brands. Yeah, there, these are the ones that we use. A bit cheaper on the pocket. Let's go. Yeah, that's us. Check it, man. Yeah, no, that'd be all good. If you make island cakes and you want to do the stencils, a lot of people do the buttercream, but another way which we do is using um, edible food colors. Mm. So you see, like, this is the gold that we use now, and it lasts for ages. Yeah, it does. Like, it's like massive, but this is what we started off with, like, these little tubs. Yeah. And it's so cool because there's so many colors. Those little tubs are alright as well if you're not yeah. doing too much. Yeah. But oh, we, we do a lot of gold, so that's yeah. why we just grab that massive one. <laughs> yeah, some ones will, f it's, it's black and gold is there, and then the red, all our followers, they love it. Yeah, they got them all here. Uh, the birthday. Yeah. No, yeah, one should two. be enough. No, but I said I already had two. No, that, that should be, be enough, enough yeah. yeah. That looks more like pink. No, yeah, no, I'm just showing you the top size. This is the one I have. Yeah, no, that should be enough. She's asking me because um, I'm the pattern king around here. I'm the brownie king. So for everyone that keeps thinking it's just Cherish. Uh, but she actually does a lot of it. He I does crumb the baking, coat. he does the, um, the crumb coating, filling, he makes the buttercreams. He actually does a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm coming up with these bangers, you know, it's, it's all on. And he does the patterns. Oh, look at this one. Does that look like nice gold? That's the thing, like sometimes like the colours they say is like rose gold on it and then when you put it on the cake it's like brown, you're like... Yeah, that looks brown. I think yeah. the one that you showed me yeah. before is better. A little bit higher so they can see the... They didn't have the two inch before. Everyone say, what are you on about? <laughs> um, this is, <laughs> yeah, these things, yeah. So they it's clear. Really cool, but you could fill it up. Yeah, and you can add it into the cake like as it's a like spacer. A oh, careful. Babe, you don't want to crack it. Wait the fuel light. Flyers have been secured. <laughs> Let's go. What have you got going? I got the cream cheese and the buttercream going at the same time. Swiss meringue. Mountie's got the Swiss meringue and Kenny's got. <laughs> Alright, that is. Where is your coffee, sir? <laughs> Today is our crumb coat and fill day. Fill and crumb coat, me. I just say it that way. Fill the cakes in crumb coat. Um, this is actually usually Richie's day. I normally do the the final coat, eh, babe? Yeah, straight, straight away or? Sometimes we do, yeah, after Richie does, but today because we've got more cakes, we're just gonna do the fuel and crumb coat. 
And then tomorrow I'll final coat the, the cakes. This is what church does, yeah. Yes. To give it some... Grip. Yeah, the cake to grip onto it. I got portrait mode on. <laughs> it's like blurred it out. So, so what we're doing here is we're creating a border. <laughs> you gotta create a um, wall or a dam to keep the filling in. See, two, three scoops should be enough. And because the cream cheese, it's softer than your buttercream and it won't harden as much as once it's put in the fridge. So you need um, the buttercream to keep it in. So that's how we do that out of. I used to like, um, go like fill it right up, like thinking I'm doing like the customer, like, you know, justice. <laughs> yeah. Like I'm like, it's more, like as me, I'm like more is better, but yeah. in this case it's not. You just need the right amount. Yeah. I also just... It actually needs to be like a little bit lower so that when the cake sits on it, it doesn't go down too much. And also yeah, in there. it doesn't spill out. Because it's pretty, um, the cream cheese will start running because it's runny. Yeah, and... it's real soft. So, yeah. Man, yeah. These are so... <laughs> you should have um, cut the hole bigger. Oh, yeah. yeah. Is this your one or my one that I do? I don't even know. Yeah, you cut my one um, smaller. Maybe it was mine. You know why I do that though? Like I do it with the other ones? Why? It's because um, I tend to, like when I cut the whole bigger, I tend to go... Yeah, overdo much. it. <laughs> <laughs> I was filming the... Cutting the cakes, all the cakes in it and... Oh, it's so annoying when you're trying to film content. So I was trying to film for um, Instagram. Just so makes dumb, everything man. so much slower and oh, just trying to get everything right. Doesn't help with our um, unco colors in the back of Richie. <laughs> we just moved into this house and it's the, it's the worst. Cause... I know the walls are like blue and look, the curtain is brown. <laughs> It is what it is. It is what it is, you know. It's not like, bad. it would be nice if, like, mm. um, the house we were just before, it had white walls yeah. and everything, so it was so easy to film. And it was. was in this one, it's just, bruh. <laughs> like, it's like an 80s sort of look, you know? Like, it actually looks like those, you know, those houses of the pool? Like yeah, in the, in the movies. Yeah. Oh, man, just, like, <laughs> but, yeah. But, you know, it is what it is. The, how your kitchen looks in there. Yeah. It's about what comes out of it. <laughs> this is what you call the crumb coat. Yeah. Because it seals, seals in all the crumbs so they don't get into the final coat. Yeah. Oh, that'd be that be the worst. Eh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. My wife she makes it easy. She's like, you just go like this. Oh, See, that is cool. easy. It actually is. Before you put it in, what you want to do is just get a bit of this off, you know, just a bit. <laughs> so it can look a bit decent, you know. <laughs> what you do there is it. Done. done. Uh, it's a Thanks, <laughs> me. I'm gonna smash some Oreos. I think this challenge isn't hard enough. Try being a cake up. The cake's everywhere. And sweets. <laughs> Look at this goodness. This is our Oreo Swiss meringue buttercream. I literally just add the crushed Oreos to it. Mm-hmm. Have a taste of the Oreo cream cheese. Oh no, Swiss meringue. How is it? Good? Mm. <laughs> yeah, you're doing that so that now it's alright for you to have one. Yes. <laughs> <Turn. laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm.
<laughs> You'll fit it out. <laughs> no, but yeah, we always um, take photos in that, eh? Of our yeah. Dolphins in that. But um, why are you trying to take a photo for today? Because oh, today it ends, so I always put up a photo when I'm ending it or when I'm mm. starting it. So in our other vlog, I think it was week four and five, did yeah. I say? Or three and four? Yeah, and yeah it's mad. that was the first drop of this tea, and now this is the second drop, eh? Yeah. It's mad because uh, like, I'm not a model, I'm not a, yeah. uh, like, I don't know about clothes, and I just like, uh, it's good to <laughs> get people, like, uh, to show people, because they've seen me, like, but you don't have to be a model or nothing to dress mm. nice and things like that. So. Yeah, but you always dress nice. Look at that. See why for what of gum manga Because he hasn't got enough. <laughs> Before I cut this up, I wanted to show and have proof of how massive this zucchini is. Look at it. That's a what is it? Cucumber. It's a zucchini. Bro, that is not normal. That is massive. My mum she must have grossed this steroids. in the back of her like what the. F <laughs> Some steroids, she dropped it off with the banana box and it was almost like the length of the banana box. Bro, look how... I don't know what she's using, but steroids. we need some of that. <laughs> okay fam, today is Thursday. We really failed at trying to get more of the cake uh, uh, filming going on, but we just finished our workout. Um, we're gonna go grab some stuff from I Love This Shop. It's another like a uh, party supply shop. I need to grab some fondant from there and then hopefully we'll be able to capture some of the stuff that um, some of the cake decorating we do today. But yeah, did you work out? Oh, it's tremendous. I don't know how you can put a hoodie on when it's. I have to. There's no shower. Oh my god, it's so hot today. What's the. Apparently it's gonna be uh, 37 degrees today. It's so you can feel the heat already. That is crazy. I forgot to bring a shirt because now that I'm doing cardio after weights and that, I get all sweaty from mm. the run that, that I'm doing. We're still on it, day 18. So you run? Uh, oh, you're past halfway. And we're halfway through our 12 week yeah. challenge. We're in week 7. It's a hard thing because I'm trying to um, keep my strength. So I'm not. We're eating all right, like good, but yeah. at the same time. I don't want to get weak, and if I if I start like um, eating no carbs and things like that, I won't end up being able to lift heavy. So I'm like <laughs> lean down or get stronger. I, I like being stronger. Came for fondant, but it's a bit too expensive here. Um, and I'll probably grab it from Coles, but grab some Tylos powder or CMC. This helps you like harden any fondant work that you're doing. Uh, doing a wedding cake. Uh, the time is 12 12. We've got a little visitor here. It's... <laughs> this is some of the perks of uh, having a, a, a what is it called? Working from home and that. You know, but hey, we get it done. But yeah, this is what we're doing at the moment. It's for a cake, a wedding cake tomorrow. So yeah, got our best friend coffee. So this is my side so far, <laughs> and this is Richie's side. Oh, you had a vibes in Not bad, not bad. I, I taught you well. I yes, I did teach you well. <laughs> if you see a lot of people um do this this style they kind of just like throw it on in it like but us we literally put each one one. yeah like show show one them one yeah but we buy like more than what we need so that uh, we can use most of the long strands or like the long flakes because they have like a lot of yeah. like some packets come in like half of it's like the tiny <laughs> oh huh. it's, like, angle. it's literally like flake by flake that yeah. we do so when you order this cake make sure you appreciate it it's like one yeah. by one <laughs> it's not like a grab oh, yeah. and yeah. stick it on like you see so some like, people look at that that's heat yeah. yeah. and then if only we were to count it it'd be like 
1,000 flakes stuck on the <laughs> these dramatic ones. <laughs> but yeah, that's the effect um, that we do when we say that it's like coconut ruffles. These are our coconut ruffles. <laughs> Not bad. It's yeah. Not bad much, right? Yeah. It's fast when we do it together. Yeah. When it's just one person, it feels like it's just never ending. Days, um, <laughs> when I never knew how to do it, and that mm. you used to do it. Even yeah. Like crumb coating, final coating, a lot of things there. And you yeah. Do. But you learned pretty fast once um, once we were doing the cake business full time. You actually learn really fast. And I think it's because you just have like the most amazing teacher, right? Pretty much. <laughs> right, if I can teach Richie, bro, I could I can teach anyone. Nah, but you actually learn fast with anything. Mm. <laughs> now let's get this done so we can get some rest because we gotta go early um, and check out the flower market tomorrow oh, yeah. or the flower place that we go to. Come on, babe. Shh. Hey, hey, Just get off your phone. Story, get off your phone. Know, we're still up. <laughs> this is my song. I surely. Shh. Everyone wants to be a baller, but no one wants to put in the work. Get out, baby. You know what? Where are we? We're in flower shop. So this is grown florist in Mooney Ponds. If you're in Melbourne. Mooney, what? What was it called? Mooney Ponds. <laughs> Florist. I see it. Look at all the nice flowers, man. Nice. This is what we got so far. And that. Is that all we're getting from here? We'll come to the the other flower shop and getting more roses. These, these guys always have the little roses, these little ones, and that other shop that we're at not, normally have the big ones. Some greenery. Damn, look at all the different color roses, blue even. forget the keys it can work the whole time we drove like 20 minutes away from home yeah. and then it wasn't until I turned it off and I realized and we're like oh shoot the key <laughs> but lucky we parked at the back and um, it wasn't well we just had to move now so imagine, if we, it off, imagine if we turned it off over there where the wedding was I know. Oh, oh my, my gosh it's right when you went in Man, that means oh we my gosh we're to carry away. like the cake yeah oh, we had to carry the cake as through well. in front of everyone Cake is set up and done. Probably gonna go home, clean up, finish the other ones. And yeah, Gosh. I'm so hungry. Me too. We're gonna grab something to eat. I'm yeah. hungry. <laughs> something filthy. <laughs> Hi. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning now. Mm. Um, just finishing our last cakes while we um, before we go out to deliver them. Just adding some finishing touches to this ombre cake now. Here is this ombre. Excuse the mess in the background. It gets crazy when we start decorating. 
And look how pretty this green ombre is. I'm just gonna add some gold um, leaf to it and then some greenery. And we are done. We forgot to film this cake for the vlog, but here I am piping a matte effect on the bottom tier. This was a cake that we made for a Samoan lady who was turning 106 years old. We added a ula nifo onto this cake. Uh, this is not the usual way that we did it, but I wanted to try something different and we really loved how it turned out. Um, this is all we stacked, understand? The rest is stacked at the restaurant when we drop it off. Uh, here we are uh, putting on the top tier. There is a clear acrylic um, tier in between the top and the middle tier. And this is us trying to figure out how we're going to drop it on there because there's glue dots there. <laughs> And I'm just checking to see if it's centered. Um, yeah, and then on top goes the custom cake topper. And we're pretty much done. Oh no, I forgot. There's um, the flowers that I made. <laughs> so these boards just went on uh, all three tiers. Two on each tier. And that was done. Um, the family that we delivered this to were so lovely. They were so nice and kind. Um, and man, we just couldn't believe that we we got to make a cake for someone who was turning 106. Like, what a blessing for them and for us. But yeah, that was it. Hey fam, it's Sunday today. We actually got in a nice and early workout. We went to church and now we're at the beach. Um, it's 31 degrees today, so we thought we'll come and bring the boys. Look at this kid. He jumped into the beach before we could even change him. <laughs> and of course he's trying to drink the sea water <laughs> He went all the way up there Eli went with his nana so it's just us <laughs> Yeah <laughs> what did you find? I got this on the bread. Oh, what the heck? This is the best you can look closer. Okay, oh, oh. I'm gonna throw it in there. <laughs> when I always throw it, Mama always. It always goes in the water, then comes back up. <laughs> Get it, Ezekiel. Ezekiel is all fresh now. See how long that lasts. Watermelon, babe. Um, babe, watermelon. I love a fun oily my Baby, just take one. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. Yeah. Stone fans um, come to the end of week seven, and as, it, as you can see, you know, it's, a, it's a constant struggle. It, it really is. Um, no, it's a balance. <laughs> really? Like you do real well, and then you just like. You know, you, you and then you're like me. treats. Yeah, like we just finished church and that. And my wife she twisted my arm. <laughs> yeah. um, it like, was you. You I said lazy Mose. Like we were driving and my wife's like, come on, let's just get into those and get us a cheesecake. She knows exactly that um I'm lettuce and so like, Excuse hey, me, it. this was your choice. We're probably gonna be in the toilet the whole night. This was his choice. But, hey, no one believe in him. In all seriousness. Um, appreciate everyone that's watching and just hope, uh, hope this kind of shows that you know we know the struggle I know the struggle <laughs> to like that. So we've said once again this next week we're gonna go solid for the last five weeks <laughs> I'm thinking of going carb free and eating under my calorie deficit <laughs> After mocking me when I said that I was gonna try. Yeah. So, so now the challenge next week is to not have a cheat meal. Because look at it. Uh, but yeah, I uh, appreciate yeah. everyone that's watching us. Um, and um, we were meant to do more of the behind the scenes for the cakes, but it got a bit crazy it's and it's busy. It's and it's 
life happens. <laughs> so yeah, sorry about that. We tried our best. Hopefully we'll try a bit another time. But so I'd just like to say, if you're already subscribed, we love you. If you're not, what are you doing, bro? <laughs> okay, it's for free. Subscribe, hit the notification, hit the bell. Hit whatever you need to hit on there. And uh, <laughs> until we catch you on the next vlog, so far. So far.